David and Danny had the idea to satirize James Bond. Uh, they hired Mel Brooks and Buck Henry. Uh, Buck Henry and uh, and uh, Mel Brooks wrote uh, a pilot called uh, Get Smart for Me and uh, was submitted to ABC and the guy at ABC turned it down. Uh, ABC did not like the script uh, and essentially turned it down. These are quotes. You can't have the head of an international criminal empire called Mr. Big be played by a midget? America has great respect for its criminals. So he turned it, honest to God, he turned it down, saying those things. So we now had a Get Smart script and no commitment, and it was the end of the pilot season. The script had been written for Tom Poston. It was much more physical uh, in the Harry Langdon, Buster Keaton style. Mel was in uh, the polo lounge or someplace looking sa sad and sorry, and an NBC executive says, what's the matter, Mel? And he says, well, they just turned down my, my pilot for at ABC. And he says, well, listen, I've got a guy called uh, Don Adams that we're paying until he gets a show. Let me have a look at it and we'll see what that was it. NBC. But I, I, I really didn't mourn very much. I, I didn't know enough to mourn, so. The only comment I had from the network uh, when they saw the pilot was a note that told me to change Don Adams' strident delivery. Uh, uh, that was negated by an imitation of Don Adams done by the, one of the astronauts on the first moon flight when something went wrong, said, sorry about that, Chief. Uh, within four weeks, he was, uh, everybody was doing their version of Maxwell Smart's voice.